Okay, so, oh damn, it's zoomed in. Gotta zoom out, zoom out. Oh, they're zooming in. I'm so ugly, I'm so ugly. Uh, slow zoom out, make it more cinematic. Okay, so what up, SOS family? Jeez. Yo, I am so sore still. I feel like it got worse. Luckily, today isn't a workout day. So I still got another day of rest. And I'm hoping that I'm not so sore to the point where I can't work out tomorrow. <sighs> the first episode of... Well, the first episode and the uncut episode of power... I keep saying powerlifting, man. It's bodybuilding. Size over strength. Anyway, the first episode of Bodybuilding with Calisthenics, along with the uncut episode... They've been doing pretty well, 15 hours in, almost a thousand views for both videos. Sur surprisingly though, the uncut version is getting the most views. You guys, you guys are mostly watching the uncut version, more than the official episode. Hey, you see, you see why I brought out two, you see why I brought out two different parts? Because again, I know there's some people who will rather watch the uncut workout, and there's some people who want to watch the official. See, like, I know what I'm doing. I, I kind of know my, my subscriber base by now. I know the SOS family. I did this strategically. I knew some of you guys really want to watch the uncut version, right? Sorry if my lips are looking dry and chappy. I just woke up if I didn't say that already. I'm freaking sore. <sighs> you guys want to see the love y'all been showing? Let me show you. So look at this. All of these comments y'all left, man. All of these comments y'all left. Nine pages. Wait, I'm trying to like scroll through. Like nine pages. I'm not gonna go through all the nine pages, but y'all left like nine pages. Nine pages on my phone worth of comments. I didn't reply to, I think I replied to like one person. But I didn't reply to everybody yet because I'm like, you know what? Let me just have most of the comments come in. So I can reply at one time because usually when I start replying on the go, it's like it's just never ending. Like imagine if I spent the entire day replying to all nine pages at one time. Like I mean, like as they come in, it will just take so long, and I'm just like, you know what? Let me wait till it kind of slows down, and then I'll reply to all of you guys. And on top of that too, I like seeing you guys interact with each other. Like when I reply to all of you guys at first. Y'all talk to nobody else. Like, y'all just talk to me, you know? But when I actually let you guys see each other, you guys actually talk to each other. It's cool. Like, I like seeing the SOS family interact. We're family, man. We're family. You know? So, I appreciate that. So, I actually did go out yesterday and bought some groceries. I bought some food so I could help myself bulk just for now. This is just food for now. First thing I bought, of course, was some bananas. Easy carbs, 100 calories per banana. That's easy. I can eat like two of that. 200 grand. I mean, 200 calories. I bought some potatoes, aka fries. Two bags, two dollars per bag. I know it's not gonna be the most healthiest thing, but as I said, this bulk, I ain't really trying to go the healthiest uh, route right now. I'm just trying to get some calories in and enjoy myself. Damn, got some. Limited, some limited Cheerios. Now, I never watched this movie, and this movie doesn't look like a movie I'll make my son watch because it looks pretty Cinderella ish. Cinderella ish, and my son ain't gonna be about that Cinderella life. Nah, nah, he gets Cinderella, he doesn't watch Cinderella. I think I'm gonna have a mango just because it tastes good and it's easy calories. That's the thing about that's the thing about bulking with me is that. I'm just focusing on getting the calories. Someone asked me if I'm counting, if I'm going to be tracking my macros. No, I'm not going to be tracking my macros. Because I know if I just continue eating balanced meals, I get my calories in, I'm going to get way, I'm going to get more than enough protein that I need to build my muscle. And I'm going to be getting a lot of carbs because that's what I'm eating the most of. And the fats, I don't really care. The fats, like, man, I'll put it this way. I'm eating less fats than I did before. And I still didn't get fat. So... Again, I don't really care that much. I'm just trying to have fun. Tracking macros and doing all that is just going to make it annoying for me. But here's what I'm going to be eating for today. 
Rice and peas and some chicken again. I know, guys. I know. Like in the first episode, I showed y'all I was eating rice and chicken, and now I'm eating rice and chicken again. But guys, it's bulking. Like you guys know that rice is like the number one thing that people will buy when it comes to bulking. And on top of that, it, I live in a Jamaican household. We eat rice with like freaking everything. Seriously. So y'all are gonna be seeing a lot of rice and chicken. But I did buy some potatoes. So right there, some potatoes. I hope I got it on camera properly. And the reason why I bought the potatoes is because I'm planning on trying out a vegan meal. Just a simple vegan meal. Of course, some of you guys know I want to go vegan already. And I'm not going to explain why I'm not going full vegan now. Or vegan, plant-based. Let me say plant-based, yes. I'm going to try a plant-based meal. I bought some vegetables, like some uh, frozen vegetables. Right? And basically, I'm going to make a meal with a lot of potatoes and vegetables because I remember my mom made it one time because she just wanted to be healthy and dang like I enjoyed it I'm gonna put some spices some you know seasonings and stuff on the potato and I'll probably should I make a separate video you guys comment down below tell me if I should make the prepping of the meal a separate video like you know how Chris Jones does his meal videos you guys tell me that because I don't really want to do a a, a, a full cooking video in bodybuilding with calisthenics. You guys know it's mostly about the gains and just the meal and stuff, not actually cooking it. You get my point? So you guys comment that down below if you want to see that. Okay, so here's something about my mom. She would cook a lot of food, right? See, there's like a lot more chicken in here. There's like three, three chicken legs in here. And usually I will only have one chicken the day she makes dinner, so which was yesterday, and I'll take another chicken for leftover with some rice. But basically, a lot of the time, the chicken, sometimes chicken will go to waste, it will just sit in the fridge, and it's just not being put to, put to good use. So, you know, I'm like, you know what? I'm bulking. I need to make these gains. I'm taking two chickens, and no, guys, it's not because I need more protein, whatever, whatever, nah. I'm just eating it because of calories, and it tastes good. It's barbecue chicken. Straight up, I'd rather have that than eggs in the morning every single time, right? We don't got that much food in the house, so I'm just eating as much as I freaking can so I can put on this muscle. And, yo, I'm having the two chickens. I don't care. I'm going to have the two chickens. So that's a drumstick, drumstick, and the thigh, and the thigh, I think. I don't know. Whatever. I'm having the two chickens. I'm getting ready to edit parallel. Oh, my gosh, man. I keep saying freaking powerlifting. Bodybuilding with calisthenics. I'm getting ready to edit Bodybuilding with Calisthenics episode 2 and reply to all your guys' comments on the episode 1. Uh, but let me tell you guys something. The soreness I am feeling right now. You guys are going to watch episode 2. This is like episode 3 right now, right? So you guys are going to watch episode 2. And you're going to see that I did the squats, the, the pistol squats. And let me tell you, just those three sets, those, that was the only thing I did for legs that day. And let me tell you, this is like, besides my arms, that feels like the most sore part in my body, my legs, or my ass. When I, I had to try to take a, it was so hard to take a dump yesterday. Like when I sat down on the toilet, it felt like the most excruciating thing ever. Like, oh my gosh, oh my gosh. I'm done training legs. I'm done. I don't care. I'm done training legs. I'm not training legs anymore. Man, y'all are something else. Like, leave the man alone. He's trying to show some support, man. Yo, every time Vegan Gains comments on my videos, there's always some people just, like, attack him. Just like, yo, Vegan Gains? Yo, I hate this guy. Oh, you're skinny as fuck. But, like, leave him, man. Just like, yo, let him be. Right? A lot of you guys, some of you guys been asking me to make a video on him. I, I will. And I, I think a lot of you guys may not agree with what I'm going to say, but yo, I don't care. I speak my opinion. I speak my, I, I, I'm not going to change my opinion to please anybody. But I'm just saying, leave the man alone. Like, yo, the man's showing some support. Like, dang, man. Come on, guys. Come on. I expect more from you guys, SOS family. Chill out. So it looks like the meal is ready guys. Damn, that's probably like a good five to six hundred calories. I'll say 550. So guys, I'm about to enjoy my meal because I love my mom's rice and peas and barbecue chicken. And I'm telling you guys, like this is calorically dense if you ask me. 
guys so today is wednesday and i'm supposed to be doing my upper body day basically it's my push and pull but let me tell you something my biceps and forearms are on fire from sunday's workout like i swear when I, i'm not joking i'm not joking at all it is feeling like someone was trying to tear my bicep off of my bone like it hurts it hurts so badly i can't even extend at the elbow properly this is the furthest i can extend so basically beyond this i have to like force it and try to stretch it out myself let me show you guys something okay look at this guys usually my arm could just lay lay straight out on the bed look at this now it can't even lay straight out on the bed and look at my other arm Look at my other arm. That's my biceps and my forearms being so sore and tight. It can't even lay straight out. Why? 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 The thing is though is tomorrow is Thursday which is going to be the second workout day of the two between Wednesday and Thursday. So I'm still going to try to get something in on Thursday and have there be an episode on Friday. But then again, if you're watching this right now, then this is Friday's episode. Therefore, that means I actually did get a workout in to show you, to make power, not powerlifting with calisthenics, bodybuilding with calisthenics. So anyway, I'm just trying to let you guys in like, yo, calisthenics, it's going to snap your shit up. So I've been telling y'all I was going to be making a vegan meal, but because there is no meat, I put a lot of potatoes and a lot of vegetables in it. So it's high volume, I'm assuming... With all these potatoes, it's high calories or it's, calor it's calorically dense, if you will. Uh, it's pretty good. Be because of the ketchup, of course. It basically tastes like fries. So it ain't like the best gourmet meal, but I'm trying out here, bruh. So let me enjoy this meal. If you guys would like me to actually show you guys how I prepared it, leave a comment down below and I'll see what I can do. But I ain't promising anything. Oh my gosh, guys. I'm trying so hard to finish this. So hard. It's so filling, though. Is my nose runny? I think it's runny. It's so filling. That like, jeez. And I put some pepper in it, too. And now it's making my nose all runny. And man, yo, I love my chicken. Some I might even try it with chicken next time. Because that's the thing. When I, whenever I eat fries... Or potato, I always eat it with meat. Like, that's, it just has to go together. Sorry if I look disgusting with the boogers running out my nose. I don't think you guys could actually see it, really. But yeah, basically, yo, you guys can try it out. It's basically baked vegetables and baked potato. I wish I baked it a bit longer. And it's not bad. Like, it's not a bad meal. It's just that, yo, I love my chicken. So... I don't know. I'm still going to try to go more plant-based, but hey, I know I'm not going to go fully plant-based. I know for sure. I'll probably try to like limit limit the meat consumption, but not go fully plant-based. Anyway, yeah. Yo, guys, my arms finally feel good. Ah, oh, look at this. Look at this. Look at this. It feels good again. So it looks like I'm going to be getting a workout in, but I don't know if I want to do biceps today. I don't know. I'm still contemplating whether I should do biceps or whether I should do triceps and legs or blah, blah, blah. So I'm going to figure it out. You guys will see in the next clips. Anyway, I actually have to show you guys or redo the measurements for my arms, my legs, and blah, 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 because I did it completely wrong. I do not have 14-inch arms, I wish. <laughs> And uh, I gotta show you guys the way, and so stay tuned. 
Okay, I can't lie, I ate. I ate first. I kind of forgot to do the weigh-in first. But you know what? It's whatever. It's not like you guys are expecting me to gain any weight anyway. Look at that, it's dark, I'm black, so you can't see me. But yeah, uh, <clears throat> I'm gonna be around like 150 anyway. You guys really have to wait like the two weeks to see how much I really weigh, so let's check it out. 150.2 As you guys can see, this is one long ass video. This is actually me editing 40 minutes. Now that I'm done my rant, let me show you guys what my real bicep measurements are as well as my legs and probably my chest. My chest is not easy to measure, but I'll get I'll try to get the best measurements because I did it completely wrong last time. I totally do not have 14 inch <laughs> biceps. Oh my gosh, that was hilarious. I really don't have 14 inch biceps, I measured it so wrong, so let me try to get this fixed. Okay, so I basically had to measure it this way. I'm supposed to lock the thing into this little hole, if you guys can see that, and basically draw it up and make it as tight as possible. I pull it out, and I got 11 inch, 11.5 inches when it's not flexed. And when it's flexed, it was 12.5 inches. Okay, my chest measurement, let's tighten this up. Boom, I think that's pretty good. That's pretty solid. I know it's not the most accurate, but hey, I'm trying my best here, guys. So 35.5 inches, basically, it's upside down. 35.5 inches. Hey, okay, let's get my leg. Hopefully my dick don't pop out. Can't be having that G4P on here. Okay, let's bring it around. Let's lock it up. Right at the birthmark. Boom. Okay, pull it out. No pun intended. Because I clearly didn't. Okay, let me not go there. <laughs> 19 inches. 19 inches, guys. There. I don't have 22 inch thighs. Okay, I don't have 14 inch biceps. And I actually don't want 14 inch biceps. Probably... 13 max. I don't really care to be that big. Well, if it gets th if it gets that big, then cool. Uh, and my chest, I really don't care about my chest measurement. That I'm really doing for you guys. But as for my biceps, that's the the, the arm measurements are the only one I actually care about. I do want bigger arms, bigger legs too. But I really don't care about the number. Bro, you know what? Let me not work out just yet. I'm gonna play some Mortal Kombat because honestly, like I've been working so hard lately with these videos. Because let me tell you guys, these videos take so much time to record, to edit, to post up on the channel. On oh, oh my gosh, like editing both the videos, it took me like damn near eight hours to do it. It's successful though. So far that the, the series is successful, it's getting over a thousand views, both videos. You guys are actually loving the uncut version a lot more than the official episodes like this one. Uh, but honestly, I just need to chill. And on top of that, my, my camera actually does need a charge, so I can't actually go record a full workout and have my camera die on me, right? So, man, I'm just gonna chill, man. I'm gonna chill and relax and not stress myself over this. But I thank you guys for watching. I thank you guys. So, good morning again, guys. I know some of you guys are probably like, what the fuck, man? Like, are you not going to work out? It's been four days already. Here's the thing, guys. I actually did a workout yesterday. So today is Friday. I'm going to eat breakfast, get my workout in. And yes, I worked out last night, but I didn't record it because I trained in my room. I was going to go outside and train, but there was a bunch of kids outside and they were all going to get in the way because, guys, it's not a cool thing to have a bunch of kids running around while you got your tripod standing out there and stuff. And a lot of kids just like to jump in the camera and say, Hey, let me be in the video. Oh, let me try this. And you guys, you guys have seen the kids interrupt me sometimes before. You guys have seen, for those of you guys who actually watch my videos. So yeah, I'm actually really going to be getting outside and recording. I'll be doing biceps and back. And I'll just do legs tomorrow. I don't know if I'll record it. I probably will record legs tomorrow, but it will be for Monday's episode. So stay tuned, guys. Let's do the weigh-in. This time I didn't eat anything before, so this should be more accurate. Hey, 149. Okay. Not bad. Okay, so since you guys watched through so much vlog footage, blah, 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 I'll just go straight to the workout. I'll eat breakfast, and I'll take you guys outside, so... Man!
and I think I want to be getting some crazy ass muscular imbalances doing something like this. I have a backpack on with 10, no, 15 extra pounds, with 15 extra pounds in it, and I have the 30 pound weighted vest on me, all over one shoulder. I'm gonna be frigged up soon enough, man. Damn. So, SOS family, I am back again with another episode, episode 3 of Bodybuilding with Calisthenics. Now, guys, like, a lot of you guys really think calisthenics is that easy? Yo, this workout was hard. Like, calisthenics is not a game, bruh. It's not a game. So, I really tried to encourage you guys to try this out and tell me how it goes for you. Like, after doing this workout, there is no way that I could continue doing two muscle groups in one day and record it all at the same time. It's just too damn much. So y'all won't be seeing every single workout that I do, I'm sorry guys, but like, I just cannot have recording this get in the way of my gains. Like, I really want to gain these 20 pounds, okay? So, I'll record some workouts, and some workouts I just will record. I'll just work out for the sake of making them gains, and of course, over time, you guys will be seeing those gains. So just like yesterday how I trained, and you guys didn't see it, sometimes I may train legs and you may not see it. You guys may say, how can you not train legs? Trust me, I really am training legs. But since you guys missed yesterday's workout, let me just break it down real quick. I start off with some handstand push-ups and pike push-ups, and I really encourage you guys, if you guys think you're a man, you think you're tough, you think you overhead press like 300 pounds, do some handstand push-ups with your foot on the wall. After that, I did some weighted push-ups, I also did some front raises, lateral raises, and then I finished off with some dips. I think I did something else, I can't remember, but it was pretty intense. You guys try that out. It looks like all the kids came out, so... I don't think I could. You know what? The workout's done anyway. I can't train with all of them here, man. It's not. It's gonna be too tedious. I'm pretty much done anyway. Can't do the full workout anymore. I'm too tired. You see, a lot of you guys have been asking me, like, yo, where's all the kids at the kiddie park? Hey. They're usually inside. Right. Hey, like, yo. All the kids. I love you guys. I love all you guys. <laughs> That's where they are. Came outside. What? Yeah, we're gonna be on YouTube. <laughs> All the kids. But yeah, now you see how hectic it is for me to work out like this. I am finally back inside. By the way, no disrespectful comments about the kids, or as a matter of fact, no disrespectful comments about anyone that will ever be featured in my videos. Please and thank you. Anyway, I am back inside my house. And I'm about to go get some juice. Yo, one cup of this is 100 calories. I think I might have two or three. I wanna get them carbs in. It's full of sugar though, but whatever. It tastes damn good. And this is how you do it, bruh. I missed. I was trying to look on the camera. That's how you do it, yeah. That's like more than two cups. I don't care. I'm trying to get all these carbs in. Get these calories in, bruh. To be honest though, this does not beat my protein shake. Yo, guys, I might be getting the protein sooner than later. Some good stuff happened to me recently, or today. I'm not gonna say what happened though. Don't wanna speak on it, but it looks like I might be getting my whey protein. I'm gonna fill that stuff up with like, with oats. With peanut butter, if you guys can see it. Can you guys see that? Peanut butter, right here. Cinnamon, and other stuff. Oh my gosh, it's gonna taste so freaking good. When y'all try it out, you guys will thank me. My bro bought donuts, and he ate all the chocolate ones and left all of the cinnamon and the powdered ones. I'm not having any of those. I would, I would have the chocolate ones, but damn, these ones taste so dry. I swear it tastes like I'm eating rocks. So it looks like the video has to come to an end. I know this was a long video. I'm sorry about that, guys. Well, you know what? I gave you guys a lot of content in this video. Come on, I gave you guys like that those four vlog clips. There was basically absolutely nothing. And then I gave you guys that workout. Uh, you guys got to see some of the kids outside and whatnot. Blah, say blah. But yeah, it's time to end this week of bodybuilding with calisthenics the next episodes will come not next week but the week after 
So I hope you guys did enjoy the first week. I'll try to continue improving upon it. You guys give me tips of what you may want to see, and I'll see if I could actually incorporate it into uh, Bodybuilding with Cast Tanks. I really want to try to do some shopping and incorporate it into Bodybuilding with Cast Tanks, like grocery shopping, but I still feel pretty awkward when I'm in the grocery store, so I'll try my best to get some good footage. But other than that, you guys leave your comments down below. Okay. And yeah, I love you guys. No homo though.